real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. <sighs> Shit. You, uh, need some pointers? No, just warming up, that's okay. all. They say we just run it like the old days, okay? I do the interference, you make the grab, right? Yeah. Good. Go. to watch professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself so out of place here. I can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Nate? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Nadine Ross. Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. I wonder if they host weddings. Oh, yeah, they're a full service site. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. This skate wasn't on the blueprint. Locked, of course. 
horse. Okay, plan B. There you go. I see some fence up there. Nathan, come check this out. There we go. Let there be light. Bad electrical in this joint. Don't suppose you brought a... Yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Now, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. Hey, uh, should we worry that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross? I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. Guy can talk his way out of anything. This way. Hey, look the vents. That's our way out. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding a lighter. I'm holding a lighter. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <laughs> and a lot more dusty. Shh, shh, shh. Damn it. Cosa portiamo a quell'odioso miliardario tedesco? Questo con il parrucchino e quella roba sul naso. Portali. Ah, sciacco tu dei piatti. nel culo altro che questa gente tutte che faccia ammazzare e andiamo rubati ai ricettatori fresh air here we come
Hey, check this out. You see that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, that must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. In the kitchen. And of course, it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that and find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilian, Sam. All right. Shall we wait to put a headache in his underwear? We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? Oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. Not a... <laughs> Sam, you there? <clears throat> Sam? <clears throat> Sully? <clears throat> Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish.
Okay, just like riding a bike. Several hundred feet in the air. I believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> recognize recognize someone. No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Yeah. yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh, no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. How the hell are you? Rafe. How long has it been? 10 years? 12? 15. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. I don't know how you scam your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's Cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe! Body.
God, why did I pick the power room? Ecco fatto. Oh, speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing it, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once, going twice. Screw it. Then we have, have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bid brings Don't us worry. to 120. You'll be out of there in no time. I better be. <laughs> okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bid has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Your bid, signore, takes you all the way Nothing. to 130,000 euros. There's gotta be something. Come the bid on. stands at 160,000 uh, euros. Here. Yeah, give me a sec. Signore's bid makes 170,000. Yes. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. We have now reached 190,000 euros. Gotcha. My goodness, we are now at 200,000 euros in the room. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's speed, 210,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, Thank you. 
We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to begin? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000 euros. And ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. <laughs> Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fair What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. What? Sam, tell me you got the cross. Got St. Dismas right here. You wanna say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. Falso allarme. Ho visto qualcosa che ti voleva vicino alla torre. Devi farlo sapere a tutti, cazzo. Tieni gli occhi aperti. are everywhere. Okay, maybe we should have brought guns.
time and get a good vantage point. Merda, se riescono a svegliarsela, non ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. Resta concentrato. D'accordo. to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. There's the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what, I won't tell anyone if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I weren't, I would. You'd what? <coughs> Alright, fine. <coughs> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. <coughs> Don't telegraph so much. I'm just trying to make it fair. <coughs> Nice try. I gave you that one. Freebie. Oh. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Do you know how many artifacts I've collected over the years? You're gonna need to be more specific. Let me see if I can clarify! Alright, look. I'm still a little jet lag. How about we just call it even? Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smartass? You know, you're breaking a lot of expensive stuff in here. If you're not careful, they're gonna kick us out of here. <laughs> Alright, wait, wait! It's in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there! <laughs> 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 Just met your friend Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. They're trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? <laughs> By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs> 
usciva dalla finestra della biblioteca. Sto sentito, sono stupido moderno, sono mostrato i tempi. Qui, vetri rotti, ho trovato dei vetri rotti. Sono passato da, da questa parte. So. Okay. I'll meet you at the driveway. Just head towards the ballroom. All right. See you there. Victor I'm kind of stuck here. Any ideas? The fastest way is through the ballroom. Said the ballroom is locked out. Yeah. Well, now that they know it's you guys, they cleared the place out. Small room it is. You get that, Nathan? Yeah, got it. Almost to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good.
I hope I don't go to hell for this. Oh, shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right, skull and crossbones. Very good, sir. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Hodie mecum eris in paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the uh, year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but that means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now. Look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming. Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and a whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. Well, come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Oh, Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. But... <laughs> With all that you two have been through together. She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. <sighs> I can't take that chance. <clears throat> Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can, I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey. Hey, it's me, yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy all those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you, but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth. Right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Now, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Last chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. We'll see you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah. Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Sully. 
Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. <clears throat> So, uh, what happened between you and Rafe? Nah, I couldn't deal with him. I'm pretty sure he'd had enough of me. I was still coming to grips with your, uh, death and with his frustration for not finding the treasure. I'm pretty sure he was ready to kill me by the time I bailed. <laughs> Imagine what he want to do to you now. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying not to. Sam, listen. He's ruthless. I mean, even more so than when we teamed up with him. I've heard stories. Trust me, me too. All the more reason I don't feel bad about any of this. <clears throat> it's a long drop. Yeah. I need to find another way down. <clears throat> Hey, this should hold. Uh, good call. <clears throat> the hell is all this? It's excavation equipment. Shoreline? What? Look. I thought they were just by the cathedral. Shit, get out! Okay, we're good. Yeah, nice to meet you too, Shoreline. Seems like they were expecting us. And like they're searching away from the cathedral. Which means we should get to that graveyard pronto. Exactly. Why didn't you guys search beyond the cathedral? <laughs> oh, we did. A little. This place is so big, without knowing where to look. It's like shooting in the dark. Or like blowing shit up in the dark. <laughs> this place the monks had several living quarters main one being by the graveyard of course <laughs> location 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 more shoreline equipment uh, at least no shoreliners <laughs> well, maybe we'll get lucky and they'll blow themselves up Open this door. Now, what do you bet? Yep, dynamite. Yeah, be careful with that stuff, huh? Take that, Dor. You're pretty good with that stuff. Well, I've blown a lot of shit up over the years.
What's the uh, plan with the crate? I'm not sure yet. <clears throat> We're good. They don't see us. Hey, where's hey. our boys? Keep your safeties up. Think it was those guys Nadine warned us about. Either way, the orders are the same. Should be fun. Nicely done. That could have been bad. Yeah. Let's get out of here before anyone checks in on them. <laughs> there. Come on, let's go.
Got it. Oh, careful. I can hook that. Whew. All right, you think you can do that? What are you talking about? I taught you that move. All right, let's see it then. Sam, there's a ladder just out of reach. Hey, hold up. I'll come over. All right. Give me a boost. Thanks. All right, there it is. The mug storm. Just a hop, skip, and a jump away. Uh, don't jinx us. Here we go. Burns a little. Those are fun. I could do this all day. You go where the money leads you. It gets colder. I'm gonna take a leak while you educate our young recruiter. So what happened next? Did he put down the revolt? With our help, he kept nice it at bay. But once money ran out. No you get the left one. Around I got right. And the general. Gonna have to do better than that, fellas. Let's see if we can keep this up. You two done prepping the site. The cemetery is ready for each boy. They're not slowing down, are they? The first lady wants the results. She wants them yesterday. Have they found anything? Heard they uncovered some stuff. But I don't know the details.
was kind of hairy. Someone was bound to hear all that. Come on, let's get a move on. beyond those walls. There we go. We just need to reach our house get off. Easy, boo. I nearly blew. Keep going. Look at that view. <laughs> Better than bungee jumping. Have you ever been bungee jumping? No, but I'm sure this is better. So, this is what you've been up to all these years? Jumping around ruins? Yeah, that and getting shot at. Blown up, punched, kicked. All right, all right, I get it. Knifed, drugged. That's that. Uh, not quite. Still gotta climb high to cross the ravine. I hope we're done sliding for a while. My ass is full of gravel. <laughs> There's a dormitory gate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Hey, give me a hand. Come on. Yes, we are. <laughs> Jesus. Wait, look at this place. Welcome to the St. Dismas Dormitory. Alleged final resting place of one Henry Avery. It's like the scroll for the cross. The dates aren't right. Well, one down and... A hell of a lot to go. Okay. Cross cutlasses, skull and crossbones, and the date 1659 to 1699. We find a tombstone with all three, and we're in business. Well, let's desecrate some graves. Let's. No swords. Ah, oh, this isn't it. Ooh, the swords match. Let's see. Nope. Bad dates. <laughs> some scripture for you. Be sure your sin will find you out. Huh. Date is correct, but the swords are upside down. Wrong one. <clears throat> no skull and crossbones. Nice Celtic cross. Not the grave we want, though. Swords are a match. So is the year. <sighs> Sam, come here. Where'd you find it? <sighs> Benjamin Bridgman. That's Avery's alias. <laughs> Something odd about this skull, though. It's like it doesn't belong to the stone. Well, and what's odd about it is that's not Avery's sigil. Huh. Yeah, I mean, the skull should be facing. Sideways. What is that? My God. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh, I've been ready for a long time. Yeah, look at that. Let's see what we got. A crypt? A crypt? Hidden behind a secret door? I assume the secret door was added afterwards. <laughs> to hide his loot. Well, fingers crossed. Oh, ho, ho. gang's all here. Is this a door? Looks like a door. 
I don't see a way to open it, though. What are these star symbols? Jesus? Dismiss on the left. Penitent thief? Guest is on the right. Jerk thief. <laughs> Avery sure had a thing for St. Dismas, huh? Well, Avery fancied himself a good thief, right? Only plundered and murdered the non-British heathens. <laughs> Guess that's what passed for good back then. <laughs> good enough. Kind of lamp. Hey, Smokey, need your lighter over here. You know, that hurts my feelings. Not as much as it hurts your lungs. Thank you, Father Duffy. Isn't that something? Oh. <laughs> the light's coming from the other side of the wall. Let's see here. Ah, I can aim the lights. <laughs> I am loving this. Hey, here we go. I think you got that one. Oh. Connect the dots. That looks right. Nathan, that's it, you got it. That looks like a constellation. Yeah. That's Libra, the scales of justice. That's an interesting choice for a bunch of pirates. Okay, let's give this a shot. <laughs> Own treasure, Josh. <laughs> well, nice view. No treasure, though. No, but look, you see those crosses? Ah, uh, yeah. Hey, is that a cave right below? Yeah, I think Avery's trying to tell us where to go next. Uh, there's one problem, though. Going back that way means we have to go back toward the cathedral. And back towards Rafe. Shit. Well, let's not keep him waiting. Follow my lead. Shit. Anybody heard from the scout party uphill? Nothing. You think we have guests? I don't wish. The storm's been messing with the radio. The track is useless. If we don't hear back from them soon, I'll go check in with them.
No way I imagine that. Where'd you go? Wait. Watch yourself. Look the area. What the?
Okay. I think we're clear. Well, that could have gone better. Hey, well, we're still breathing. That's good enough. Let's just get that gate open. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, go! Holding up. <laughs> Great. I was kind of hoping to find the treasure back there, but you know, it's never that easy, right? That's been my experience. Plus, there was that cool constellation thing. Yeah, it was cool. Right under that high cross. That's where Avery wants us. Well, what Avery wants, Avery gets. Kid, what's your status? Hey, Sully. We're on the trail, but the uh, treasure's closer to the cathedral than we originally thought. Oh, boy. So what do you need me to do? Uh, just keep those engines warm. We'll be back before too long. Will do. What have we here? We don't need rival Very piratey. You know what? Forget it. Why'd you bring it up? I think to get back out of there. Huh? No way I am meant. Okay. What you got? Talk to me, man. I guess there's no getting away from these guys. Yeah, and there'll only be more as we get closer to the cathedral. Here we go. Come on, I'll boost you up there. All right. <clears throat> the hell, I'm too high to reach you. Yeah, hang on a sec. Hanging. 
Let me see what's by that wooden structure over there. Hey! I got something! Yep, we go. Christ, this thing's heavy. What exactly are you doing? Giving you... A way up. That'll support even your way. Ah, thank you. Hey, you don't think the monks built this? No way. It's some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? To lift something. I can't believe I missed this. Yeah. Clearly, we were meant to find it together. No, <laughs> oh, it's so romantic. You don't think the monks built this? No way. It's some kind of pulley system. Uh, to lift a whole bunch of treasure? <laughs> hey, we can climb this! On my way! This way. I see. Nice move. Thank you. Okay. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Hey! Be careful coming around the corner! Incoming! <laughs> that was amazing! Hope this holds. Especially cliffs. Tell me about it. All right, here we go. Hey, hey, you okay? Yeah. Like I was just saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, hold on, I'll, I'll see if there's. Oh shit! Sam! So, can't get to you from here. Oh, 
got it. I can't feel my hands. I think my blood thinned out or something after all those years of Panama. Yeah, well, don't worry. The worst case, you lose a couple fingers. Hold on. I'll help you up. There you go. Where would you be without me, huh? Uh, probably at home. Drinking hot cocoa? What are you, five? Oh, tell me you wouldn't go for some hot cocoa right now. Well, I mean... Yeah, exactly. We're clear. Let's hope we're done with these idiots. <laughs> hey, careful. Might be unstable after the blast. Who does excavation with dynamite? Mercenaries. I think Rafe would know better, though. Hey, Sam, help me with this. Uh, yeah, well, what if it's the only thing holding the tunnel up? Then I'll apologize. All right. <laughs> See? No problem. Yeah, for once. Ah! <laughs> 
Those things look sturdy to you. <laughs> sturdy enough. Hey, be extra careful on these. Oh, hey, look down there. Old piratey looking ships. Yeah, all of this is good. Very good. Huh. Remember, extra careful. Thanks. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. About to head into the cave. The cave? Yeah, might lose contact for a bit. Don't get too worried. All right, I'll keep the porch light on for you. All right, call you soon. <laughs> we made it. It's quite the detour. Let's go see what Avery left for us. Those shoreline assholes were right next to this cave. Yeah, but I think we're the first ones in here. Come on, through here. But I didn't eat a big breakfast. <laughs> Creepy St. Dismas statues, check. Carved stairs, check. Nathan, I think it's safe to say we're in a pirate cave. Oh, is that a door? It sure looks like it. Come here. Check this out. A little slimy. There's a handle in here or something. Well, give it a give it a pull. What? Could be a trap. You're already in there. What's the... What's the worst that could happen? Uh, I lose my hand? So we'll get you a nice hook. Give it a pull. <sighs> nice hook. All right, here we go. <laughs> really? Hello, hello. Pretty interesting decor. For those who prove worthy, paradise awaits. To those who prove false, behold your grim fate. Yeah, well, I guess Avery was a better pirate than a poet. This... this isn't Avery's. What do you mean? Look. It's the Rhode Island pirate. Thomas too. Yeah, but it can't be him. I mean, this is clearly his sigil, but two died attacking the same treasure fleet as Avery. Yeah, well, at least that's what the stories tell us. If this really is two's mark, then that means he's involved in all of this... how? It's a damn good question. Who do you think these guys are? Uh, those who prove false, I guess. I think Avery or Thomas, too, are just trying to scare us. Good thing we're jaded treasure hunters. <laughs> Good thing. Bridge looks about as safe as the others. Well, it's held up this long. Oh. 
It's okay, it's holding. Come on. These bridges are clearly not built to code. Sure they are. The pirate code.